Yes, Flo. Hi. Come on in. Oh, Flo Meredith, I'd like you to meet our chief writer, Murray Slaughter. It's a pleasure. And this is our executive producer, Lou Grant. <laughs> Hi, fellas. Pleased to meet you, Miss Meredith. You have quite a reputation. Oh, Mary seems to think you're pretty hot stuff, too. <laughs> oh, no, I do my best. <laughs> well, hey. This is a cute little place you got here. <laughs> not really. Not all that little and not all that cute. Sorry, no offense. Mary, you got a cute little boss here. <laughs> Flo Meredith? Well, what a thrill. <laughs> I'm Ted Baxter, the anchorman. Hi. I suppose Mary's told you all about me. Yes, she has. Well, now you can hear it from the horse's mouth. Well, that's almost the way she described you. <laughs> this is wonderful. It's so great meeting important people. You must be very excited. <laughs> Writer, huh? You must be having a field day with this Walker truck. Oh, yeah, uh, but I was just finishing working on a fast-breaking story first uh, on uh, the uh, putty situation. <laughs> Mary, it's your newsroom. But, honey, if I were you, I'd drop everything and concentrate on this murder trial. You'd never have a bigger story. Oh, well, uh, I'm sure that Mary feels from a television standpoint that the trial could go on for weeks. Some of these other items uh, will be old news tomorrow. Well, yeah, that's yeah, really what I... It's not on my business, but from a newspaper standpoint, she's dead wrong. Murder sells. It's a fact of journalism. You know, on the other hand, it's hard to argue with that. I, I know a little bit about journalism myself. <laughs> not your scandal sheet scribbling, but good old hard-nosed reporting. My scribbling has won 16 journalism awards. How many has your nose won? <laughs> How many has my nose uh, won? Uh, can I say something here? I've, ne I've never done anything like this, but uh, I think we all know what's happening. I mean, you two should really like each other. But uh, somehow things have just gotten off to a bad start, you know? And I, I think uh, we should be sensible enough to admit that. You know, so that it doesn't get in the way of what could be a terrific relationship. <laughs> oh, all right, all right. I admit it. She was starting to get on my nerves. Okay, now, Aunt Flo, you too. Come on, just out. All right, baby, if it's going to make you feel any better, I was beginning to think that he was a pompous, straight-laced blowhard. <laughs> there, you see? Now that it's all out in the open, we can just forget the last few minutes ever took place and start fresh. How do you do, Miss Meredith? <laughs> I'm pleased to meet you, Mr. Grant. It's a cute little place you got here. <laughs>